guys, this is Mr. Joshy J, and in this video, I am unpacking the Aston Villa 2021-2022 home shirt. Now, I got this off of DH Gates, and it comes with a player's name, so let's get it unpacked. Here it is. Yep, the Aston Villa home shirt. Now, yeah, I gotta admit, I do like the Aston Villa shirts. They're very nice shirts. See, we've got the Premier League patch on it. Yeah, that looks nice. Kappa, I've seen heat pressed on. Oh, look, yeah, like the Kappa logo. See, a bit, a bit of plastic on that, but you can easily peel that off. XL, but again, more like a large, because this is the H Gates. But people on the moon. <laughs> yeah. Kazoo. Yep. Kazoo. <laughs> yeah, I like that logo a lot. Kepper. Yep. Again, that's seen heat press on the shirt. Aston Villa badge. Yep. That all looks good there. Yarn bit. Can't see any loose stitching at all. Oh, got another Kappa logo in there. Look. Again, heat pressed on. Any loose stitching? No, I cannot even see any. Can't see any on the outside of shirts at all, but it's more than likely I'll find some when I turn it inside out. On the outside of the shirt, nothing. That Kazoo logo does make me chuckle, though, i got to admit. Right, let's turn it inside out. Yeah, okay, the player's name I have on the back of the shirt. In three, two, one. Tyro Mings. Yes, I have Tyro Mings on the back of it. Now... He used to play for a team called Chippenham Town, which is a team in Wiltshire, based in England, in the United Kingdom, in the county called Wiltshire. He used to play for them, and obviously, that's where my grandparents live in Chippenham, so I thought I'd go for a local lad, Mains, number five. Yep, Tyro Mains. It's a no-brainer to go for this one. Yeah, quite a good defender. I had him in my Newcastle United team on FIFA 22. See, got a bit more plastic there, but again, I'll remove that. Yeah, it's seen well printed on. Just a little bit of loose thread in there and there, but... Again, that's hardly anything. Like I said, it's more than likely we'll see the flaws when we turn it inside out. Which that is exactly what I'm going to do right now. But, yeah, I do like the stripes on this kit. Yep, here we go. Yep, I thought so. See, a little bit loose stitching there on the Aston Villa logo, but not too bad. And scissors will fix that. Little bit of loose stitching along the back of the collar. Again, scissors will fix that. Under the arm. Just a tiny bit of loose stitching, but not too bad at all. Down here, all looks good to me. Yep, and there's your washing instructions. Remember, hand wash 
only and on my washing machine it's be a delicate to wash of course i subscriber manchu c x x he's already reviewed an aston villa shirt and his was in quite good condition as well so be interesting to see what he makes out this again there's the aston villa badge put my hand in the shirt I mean, the material actually feels quite decent. It's just quite impressive. Here we go. See, I, I do like the blue on the sleeve, so I think that looks quite nice. Excuse me. Yeah, can't really see any loose stitching on there. Oh, yeah, a bit up there, look. But along the sleeves and that, can't really see any at all. So that's good. Yeah, Kappa. <laughs> but yeah, this is a decent shirt. I quite like it. Yeah, there it is. So that was a review of the Aston Villa shirt. Comment calls down below. I will always reply. And join you very soon for some more DHA videos. I'm hoping to get a team from the Bundesliga next. Either by Munich or by Richard Dortmund. Yeah, so haven't ordered it yet, but that's the one I'm thinking next. So... If you'd like to see more of this stuff, please subscribe to the Mr. Joshy J channel. Bye-bye.